Hey everyone, welcome to my channel ASP.NET Core and today I'm going to uh, show you why my membership program is best for you. You know, uh, I created uh, best videos and you know, beginning to professional videos uh, for you. Uh, it's only for the .NET actually and not for other languages and you know, I will cover a full uh, .NET roadmap in 2024. So I will share you a complete video tutorial or you can say um, uh, complete videos plus uh, complete source code of the project. I will send you in just only 800 rupees or dollar $1.15. Uh, in this program, just I uh, share you C Sharp basic to advanced covered like uh, C Sharp 12 features, HTML, CSS3 and JavaScript and ASP.NET 8 with the Entity Framework Core features and Dapper, ADO.NET, Microsoft SQL Server, RESTful API, Latest Angular 2024, Latest React 2024, Microsoft Blazor, Interview Question and Answers. So I will complete uh, .NET full stack development. I will provide you a complete video tutorials and uh, you know, uh, uh, full source code. Okay, and the resource material, I mean to say that images and uh, document files and etc. Only 800 rupees and $1.15. What you do for uh, getting this types of membership, I will share you day by day video tutorials and you know, um, you get only 800 rupees or $1.15. If you belong from India, just pay 800 rupees or if you are belong from other countries, like just pay $1.15. Just, you know, it's best for you. Why it's best for you? I will share you the course content. If you want to join this membership, just fill this form, uh, full stack development, your name, your email ID, your contact number, and transaction reference ID, order ID, or PayPal ID. If you are belong from India, just pay using uh, UPI ID. And if you are belong from outer uh, uh, or other country, uh, except India, just pay uh, using PayPal. Uh, on this uh, uh, ID, PayPal ID, that is narinkumar8500 at gmail.com and you can use this QR code also, okay? And the link is actually available in video description box, so check it now, okay? So just, uh, 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 you know, uh, just to see uh, what I will provide you, okay? Here is my course content uh, in first start from ASP.NET Core. So introduction about ASP.NET Core, getting started with Visual Studio 2022 with the default template MVC, model view controller, directory structure, how MVC work, HTML helpers and built-in tag helpers, simple uh, example of MVC like button click different view sections, database connection string using entity framework core, model first approach or you can say uh, code first approach, how entity work uh, works, I will explain you. Migration, simple CRUD operation on a single model using Entity Framework Core and question answers related to these topics. Uh, that uh, will help you in your uh, preparation exam or you can say in company uh, uh, exam. Okay. So what about the relationship? I will share you three tier architecture, one to many relationship, CRUD operation on one to many relationship. 10 examples of uh, one to many relationship, it's your practice time, many to many relationship, I mean to say that a student have multiple skills or you know, a skills have multiple students. So how to uh, manage this relationship in ASP.NET Core? So it's a best example for you. CRUD operation on many to many relationship, I will give you an simple example or complicated example also. 10 examples of many to many relationship, it's your practice time. Fluent API concepts, one-to-one -one relationship, CRUD operation on one-to-one -one relationship, 10 examples of one-to-one -one relationship. Validations, what is validation? Client-side validation, how it works. Server-side validation, how it works. Custom validation, anti-forgery attacks and all. Session, what about the session? How to configure session? How to uh, authorize session? How to, you, uh, how to configure authentication session and all. So how to configure session, how to use session in ASP.NET Core. Reusable component, uh, that is partial view, partial page, real-time use of partial view, view component, real-time use of uh, view component. Themes, uh, like boots was theme setup, page utility, paging, searching and sorting, file services. And uh, generic repository is also covered, uh, unit of work that is there. 
identity, Microsoft identity, cookies authentication, registered handler and options, cookie based authentication and authorization, role management, claim based author authentication and claim based authorization. Data seeding, best use of data seeding. Real time projects, minimum two projects I will share you in this ASP.NET core, prototype, rough ideas uh, to design projects, project analysis, phase of project design, filters, what are the filters, how to use filters, middleware, what are middlewares, how to use and how to design custom middlewares. Okay, so that these are the topics which we'll cover in ASP.NET core. Now, the next one is to start with the ASP.NET core web API course and what is WCF, SOA and uh, uh, REST. Create ASP.NET Core Web API, Project Configuration, Attribute Routing, Test API in Swagger and Postman, Default Parameter Binding, Status Code, Action Results, Repository Pattern, Asynchronous Code, CRUD Operation on One to Many Relationship, CRUD Operation on Many to Many Relationship, Paging, Searching, Sorting, Data Shaping, Content Negotiation, Media Type Formatter, Radiation in Web API, Circular Object of Error Handling, Authentication authorization using JWT, ASP.NET uh, Web API Pipeline, Versioning API, Action Filters, Middlewares, Caching, Logging, Error Handling, Consume Web API using HTTP Client. Uh, create minimum two real-time projects on ASP.NET Core Web API. I mean to say that REST API. The next one is Angular. So that uh, API will consume in Angular also. So introduction about Angular, install Node.js, uh, install Angular CLI, create new project. Directory structure, running path, module class, component class, create a new component, install boots, uh, strap, use angular toolbar, routing concept, router link, router outlet, directives, ng if, ng4, ng switch, class, interface, define, array in angular, string interpolation, property binding, parent to child communication using input decorator, child to parent communication using output decorator, template driven form uh, with validation, template reference variable, and uh, reactive form design services and all like rxjs series dynamic route id life cycle event http client module session plus holder ng container ng content design course authorization guard create api project for jwt authentication view child http interceptors material components paging searching and sorting asp.net core restful api based projects also covered okay so these are the that is the uh, Angular, pro, uh, Angular co uh, course curriculum and that is the C sharp basics. Okay, so what is C sharp? Hello world program, variable, string, int, double, decimal, bool, null, date, time, date only, time, types, conversion, branches, loops and sets, methods, debugger, object oriented programming, generics and events, cre uh, create connection with the database, link, thread, like that. And data structure in C-sharp, data structure and algorithm, asymptotic analysis, big O notations, finding big O, finding uh, time complexity, worst case, best case and average case analysis, link list, doubly link list, circular link list, stack and queue, recursion, binary tree, caching, searching, sorting, heap and binary tree. Now the next one is signal R, that is the real time communication. And how is signal R, need of signal R, advantage of signal R, how to create connection, client server communication, what is hub. Signal R transport types, what is connected clients and disconnected clients, types of signal R connection, communication with the all clients, communicate with the only sender, communicate with the accept sender. So these all are push notification and uh, uh, send information to all groups members, accept group members at all. And the next one is a bootstrap. Uh, so what is a bootstrap, how to use bootstrap, container, typography, display and position, backgrounds, text, color, spacing, sizing, border and shadow component and frequency. Button, nav bar, grid columns, flex box, and all. These all are you can see. Now the next one is the microservices based architecture level programming. I will uh, share you like .NET Core microservices. If if you want to uh, literally you want to join this membership, just fill this form and get the code and get the video tutorial also. So I will help you also in your uh, uh, errors also. So. Uh, these are the concepts behind this so thank you guys for watching this video and keep watching all other videos which is related to asp.net core and full stack development if you want to learn knowledge if you want to get knowledge uh, i will help you okay so just fill this form and uh, get the membership thank you very much for watching